Hello and welcome back for some more Horizon Zero Dawn. We finally made it to Meridian. And in all honesty, it feels like I've beaten the game. <laughs> but that's just not the case. What? You're kidding me. Okay, I'll let you live. Um, yeah. We are 24 hours into the game. And I've only beaten... About 40% of the game. Which is kind of crazy. So... Since I also want to p start playing other games on my channel again... I think I'm gonna start focusing on the main story quest more. <laughs> I know, I've gotten carried away a bit, but you know, how can't you get carried away when playing this beautiful game? But what? Okay, so there's a campfire there, and there's a campfire over there, and that's just strange. I'm sorry for the wait, but all goods entering the city are subject to search. Oh. This is outrageous. We're loyal citizens. How long do we have to wait? What am I supposed to do? Just sit here and let everything spoil? I thought Meridian was open to all, Karja. What happened to Ursa has nothing to do with us. What's with the echo? That's yeah. strange. Is that just my headphones? That looks I don't know. I'll see you on the video. Just be patient and everyone will get in. Eventually. Okay, so I'll just wander in. That's cool. What do you got? Nothing new, I guess. Oh, yeah, you do. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, you do. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Nice. Oh, no. I need rabbit skins and fox skins for that. Trampler heart. Do I need all of those? Probably not for level 12 quests, which is my main story quest right now. So, not right now, mister. I can't buy it anyway. Don't have the necessary stuff. Every minute I'm stuck here causing me good shards. My duty is to guard. I don't get involved in politics. I kind of don't like how it zooms in. Lillian's in there, somewhere. And so's Aaron, that other outlander I talked to the night before the proving. Aaron said he'd introduce me to his sister if I visited Meridian. Said she was captain of the vanguard. Move along. You have no need to loiter around here. Hell, me? Hmm. Arrested two for this order. Yeah, what's up with the camera? It's just kind of weird. I mean, I I get that we've entered a city, but what's that? Why are they turning? Like rotating, I mean. That's strange. If this keeps up, I'll be broken a month. <laughs> a brightly colored outfit. Brings us it's all the the merchants. Of the You're not getting through, Outlander. Come out around the girl on by the city guard the other day. Oh, oh, That's impressive though. Hold! Huh? Oh. Me? Stop right there. In light of the recent attack, no stranger passes into Meridian without submitting to search. Recent attack? What are you talking about? The murder of Captain Ursa and her vanguards, of course. Ambushed by Shadow Carja forces in Redridge Pass. Ursa? You mean Erend's sister is dead? How would you know his name? I know Erend. Summon him. I need to speak to him. Ha! Huh. I doubt that Erend, the new captain of the Vanguard, a man in grief, is going to waste his time on a grimy outlander. Aloy! Hey, you're alive! I thought you were dead! Make way! Make way! All the way to Meridian, just to see me? Have you been drinking? Okay. Ah, uh, not really. A little. So, you're alive! This, uh, we should celebrate! The drink's on me! We need to talk, alone, and you need to pull together. Over there. So you approve? Of course I approve. 
From now on, she may come and go from this city as she pleases. As you wish, sir. There. Alone as you asked. And what did you want to tell me? I heard what happened to Ursa. I'm sorry. I know she was special to you. Special to me? <laughs> special to everyone. She always knew what to do. She bossed everyone around. She kept me in line. But now I'm supposed to fill her shoes. And instead, here I am, stumbling around in them. Well, let me have a look at them. Maybe it's high heels. I don't understand. Hmm. No, that's not what you say in these situations. I, uh... I lost someone, too. At the Proving. The man who raised me. His name was Rost. That's terrible. Why is it every time something terrible happens? Everyone else tells you the worst thing that ever happened to them, so that makes it easier. It's to connect. Yeah. Why is that? Anyway, there was something you wanted to tell me? Well, now I feel bad. A lot has happened since we last spoke. The Proving was attacked by a group of killers. Not many of us survived. We were in the village when we heard explosions up on the mountain. Some of your braves came back, said most of the contestants were dead. I've never heard such a wail of grief as the sound that rose up from your people. How did you survive? How I survived is less important than how I was targeted. Targeted? What do you mean? The killers came for me because of Owen. What are you talking about? That doesn't make sense. I need to find Owen. I need to know what he knows. But he's a friend. No, he's a traitor. I don't know who the killers are or what they want, but I do know that Owen is working with them. But, I mean... This... I don't need you to understand, Erend. I just need you to take me to him. He's not here. He went scrounging for scrap and relics days ago. It could be anywhere. Are there any places he frequents? Places he returns to? A house. Here in Meridian. Okay, then take me there. I need to search it. I guess. As long as I'm there to witness the search. Sure. I need to see Olin's place. Now. <coughs> okay, okay. Come on. Thank you very much. I like his blue eyes. So many people here all talking at once. How does anyone think? I don't. I just drink. And why do they look like knights? That girl. Is she... Apparently they're letting anyone into the city these days. Psst. Feels like high school. Must be the spire. It's huge. Huh? What? How long will a bud hide in his palace? What spire? Year after year, why does he spare those who enslaved and tortured and butchered? Errant, you should want vengeance more than anyone. Your own sister, murdered, and her death, unavenged? One more word, you scorched out slag, and I'll throw you in jail myself. Now get out of here, or I'll give you all a kick in the ass. What did he mean about Ursa's murder? Not now. Twilight time indeed. What about it? He walks kind of funny. I bet it's those shoes. And he's drunk. Okay, how are we going to get in? Oh, huh. that was 
subtle. Here we are. Try not to break anything. That other than the door. All of this for one man. It pays to have connections in the Sun King's court. Holy hell. This is starting to feel like a completely different game. Family portrait. Is that the corner of this rug is frayed, and the floor near it is worn. Okay. So I will check that out in a minute. Should I go upstairs first? I don't know if I'll be able to go back there. Let's see what's underneath. Hey, how did that get here? Question is, how to get through it? Without a key, you won't. That's a vault hatch of Azaram make. Nothing gets through. We'll see about that. Huh. Find a way to break the hatch. Use an ex like one of those terror arrows? No. Right? I don't know. We'll check upstairs first. Call it a day, girl. Wasting time. Love these colors. What's with the lamp? Also rotating. Really weird. So many details. Oh wow. No windows though. For sleepovers. Is that his family? Can I look at it? Can I can she say something about it? it oh looks yeah. Looks like a picture of Owen's family. Well, ain't that a surprise? Okay, what else? <coughs> a lot of metal here. Could be just what I need. Oh, so I need to push it down to break the vault. Looks big and heavy. Could do a lot of damage if it fell down. Well, it's gonna Let's push it then. Push. That must have been crazy heavy. I did say not to break anything, didn't I? Hmm. Her outfit is so weird. I'm sorry. I think I might need to buy a different one. This just looks ridiculous. He jumped down already. Oh wow. What's that? Poison? Now, aren't you gonna see what's down there? Oh. Um. Are you sure you're okay? I'm sober enough, alright? I don't need another lecture. That's not what I meant. I was talking about what happened outside, with the crowd. I don't want to talk about that. We're here because of what you said about Olin, so do what you need to do. Oh well. Did Olin ever invite you in? Nah. Closest I got was a doorstep to help him home after a night out. We drank a river that night, but I hold it well. Y usually. <laughs> You said Olin has connections in the royal court. Does he know the Sun King personally? No. He served the court as a scout sometimes and sold ancient trinkets to nobles, but he never had an audience with the king. If you're right and Olin's into something dark, Sun King Avad has nothing to do with it. I'd stake my life on that. Mm-hmm. I'll look around. 
That's what we came for. I wouldn't be so sure about your king. And also talking about selling trinkets. Where do I sell my trinkets that I've gathered? Those special items. Serve and they live. Disobey and I will open their throats and leave their corpses to prune in the sun. That's not very nice. They took his wife and child captive. Look like two children. Who's they? The killers. They told him to obey or they'd kill his family. Okay. Is that it? No. A book. What's that? A map. A map. The glyphs show places he visited. Okay. Guess he was looking for something. Looks like Olin kept a journal. Olin? I knew he could read contracts, but I never took him for a poet. No doubt now. Olin knew I was targeted. Hmm. <coughs> Excuse me. Fourth day, I'm a traitor now and see no way out. If I start at the beginning, how they turned me, perhaps I can see something I missed. No, there is no escape. What good can writing it do? Tenth day, you gave me this folio when you taught me to write. All these years later, it smells of you. Lavender and ash of the forge, all I have left of you. Write me notes, you said when you gave it. Share your thoughts, tear the leaves, send the pages. To show I'm thinking of you, but I never did. Hands too grubby to touch parchment. How I wish I'd done as you said, how I wish I could now. Fifteenth day, the same dream, your hair in the forge light, our son's weight on my shoulders. All of us free. You turn to me and whisper, it is a dream. I answer, yes, I know. And then wake, alone. Even awake, my life is a dream, a lie. My treachery will not buy your freedom. It only buys time. But every moment you live, that he lives. If treachery is the cost, I will pay it. 34th day. Every week the device calls me in secret to a new dig site. We work like men with whips to our backs, as though it was left to us to upturn the soil of the entire earth and time has run low. Scrabbling to find the carcasses of ancient demons. It's the weapons they want, must be. What misery am I helping birth into this land? 38th day. I drink with Erend and Ursa, but not even the sweetest brew can wash the taste of guilt from my mouth. Every day my silence betrays them. The villains watch through the device. I keep expecting Ursa to stick a blade through my throat, but fire and spit she does not suspect me. A better liar than I thought myself must be. Fitful sleep the past three nights, thinking on that Nora girl. Why did it order her killed? The device must be. Even so, what threat could she pose? Why did it order her killed? What is it? The device? His device, I mean? I don't know. We heard explosions and distant screams from the village. I thought the savages might blame us, turn, turn on us. I almost wished for it. But their matriarchs ordered us gone. We fled to the border with an escort of braves, crossed a day tower. Now I am called to a dig in the rock wreath. They promised another glimpse of you, of our son. How I hope to see you both. That's really sad. There's your proof. Read the last page. He writes about meeting me and the order to kill me. He called himself a friend. That backstabbing cheat. How did you learn to read glyphs? And these things that you see, how do you do it? The focus. It reveals the unseen. And Olin's focus. It's the same? The device is the same, but somehow Olin and the killers can speak to each other with their focuses over distances and see through each other's focuses too, like looking through each other's eyes. 
So that's how the killers saw you? Through Olin? Yes, so far as I can tell. Now that I know where to find Olin, I should be on my way. All by yourself? Leave it to me. I'm faster on my own. Wait. If that device lets you see the unseen... Out of the way, Erend. I'm asking you to help me, Aloy. I need to know who killed Ursa. Not just the, the Shadow Karja army, I know that, but the exact soldiers who did it. I'm sorry about your sister, but that's your war, not mine. Don't act like this isn't personal. You came here hunting the people who nearly killed you, who massacred your people. Why should you have justice and not me? Look, I'll head for Redridge Pass, where Ursa's body was found, and wait for you there. A few minutes of your focus is all I need. Don't make me beg. Redridge Pass, you said? I'll see what I can do. He's still kind of hot. So is that a main quest now or a side quest? Finding his sister. Okay. So that's weird. Why is this one level 12 and this one level 19? Hmm. This one's closer, so I guess I'll do that first. I hope there's no choice involved, like I won't be able to do the other one. Oh, there's quests here too. Oh, there's tons of quests. Place. Smells like nothing I've ever smelled before. Is that some kind of spice? Huh. I wish the sun would come up. What's that? Wait. Specialty merchant? Oh, that's where I sell my stuff. Hunter big game box. Small game box. Tiny game box. Okay, that's weird. Mysterious box. Stranded shackles, stranded figure, stranded necklace. What the hell? I don't know what that is. Can I, like, where do I sell my special items, please? Tell me. Hmm, <coughs> okay. I don't know. We all have our place in the order of things. Hmm. I guess while I'm here, I should maybe really check out this place. Can I go up here? No. 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 Well, that's kind of a shame. Why put stairs there if I can't go up? It's kind of weird. Not for the first time. The longer we stay here, the more to feel like. Um. No, I guess I can't get through here, but there's a box. Ukan, you have a name? Why do you have a name? Hmm. You're an outlander. Nora from the look of you. I'll bet you're a machine hunter, too. Uh-huh. I've hunted my share. Well, let me give you a word of advice. Don't bother with the Hunter's Lodge. If you're not Karja, you'll never rise in the ranks. Are you saying that you have to be Karja to join the Lodge? No. They take other tribes. But they have rules in place to keep outlanders from gaining ranks. Mm -hmm. When Sun King Avad took over, he promised the new day, Meridian, open to all. But it's a sham. Sure, you can get a seat at the feast, but you just can't eat the food. What's wrong with the hunting lodge, exactly? Nothing, if you like stuck-up bigots. I'm known as a skilled hunter back home in Banur, so I thought I'd try my luck at the lodge. I thought it'd be simple. 
hunt machines, gain ranks, see who's best. But it doesn't work like that at all. It's all rigged to keep the Karja at the head of the line. <laughs> I don't need those snobs to tell me I can hunt. I'm going home. I like his headpiece. Sounds like someone needs to shank things up at the lodge. Maybe. But it isn't going to be me. If you decide to go, be sure to give them a good old-fashioned Banuk farewell mark in my honor. A Banuk farewell mark? What's that? Piss on the floor. <laughs> Preferably someplace they won't find it until it gets nice and sour. <laughs> wow. Will do. Will do. Oh my god, look, he's Wolverine. Or an assassin. Not sure. I wish I had that cape. That's kind of cool. But no, gotta look like a clown. I wish the sun would come up already. Okay, another specialty merchant. All right. What did you want to discuss? Hmm? You're an outlander, which is good. But a Nora, which might be bad. <laughs> okay. Do you fear the ruins of the old ones like many in your tribe? No. No. Although some can be dangerous. Then you may have come across what I seek. Yes. In your travels, have you found strange vessels? emblazoned with symbols of the old ones uh-huh they consist of a hollow cylinder with a crescent handle affixed at both ends huh if you bring me these vessels in sets of four i will gladly trade what i have for them Jeez, i don't know what sort of ritual were these vessels made for i'm convinced they were used in conjunction with each other in sets some people believe they were used for tea ceremonies Others think they held sacred essences and oils for worship. But I believe they were used for the solemn custom of shaving one's beard. <laughs> one for water, one for lotion, and so on. <laughs> each fluid in its special vessel, majestically applied to the face at each stage of the rite. It must have been breathtaking. <laughs> but which vessel was used for which? I have to know. I have to continue my research. Are you sure people didn't just drink out of them? Drink? <laughs> out of such finely crafted earthenware? Don't be ridiculous! Okay. So you're interested in the old ones? More than interested. I study every ancient artifact I can get my hands on. But years of study have made me too comfortable at my desk. I can't even bear the sun if the truth be known. I don't know how I'll manage to take a partner. My family presses me for an heir. Uh, don't look at me. <laughs> oh, no, 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 I'm, I'm not looking. In fact, my father already has someone he wants me to wed. She doesn't interest me. I wish I had a brother to carry this burden. I would rather be left to my precious little vessels. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, trade quickly. I have work to do. Okay, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. do I have... Okay, what's that? I can't buy that. I can't buy. It. Oh, I can't. What? no! I can't buy that. Can't buy that. Great. So I can't buy anything. I guess I. No, I've bought all of them already. Okay, great. Ugh. So I can't buy anything. Yet. What's even in it? I don't know. But I'd like to know. I will leave you to the hunt. Be sure to delve into the ruins. Sure, we'll do, ah, we'll do. You're everything I'm not. Strong, <laughs> brave, active. Come, talk a spell. <laughs> okay. You there, can you help me? Huh? You with the second sight, I need your help. What's you're up? the one the vanguard has been crowing about. The Nora who tracks criminals and traitors with her second sight. If only you'd use it to help me. A thief raided my home and took my brother's sword. Tell me about the robbery. Don't leave anything out. It was brazen and professional. They took only the sword, my most valuable possession. The thief went out through the window and scared the shadow off my steward. Otherwise, it would have been a clean getaway. Why would someone steal the sword? It's priceless. Made from the burnished antler of a lancehorn, finely inlaid with studded stones all down the... Uh, okay, I get it. <laughs> Forgive me. 
that's not even why it's important. The Twelfth Sun King gave it to my brother for his military service. He was killed in battle during the liberation. I was saving it for my nephew who stranded at Sunfall with the Karja in shadow. How did your nephew wind up in Sunfall? Most of the old clergy backed the Mad Sun King, so when he fell, they ran out of fear of retribution. As an honor guard to a venerable priest, my nephew had no choice but to go with them. Now that my brother is gone, my nephew is my heir, so that sword really belongs to him. And after all he's been through, I won't be able to look him in the face if I don't get it back. Okay. I'll see what I can do about the robbery. Have a word with my steward if you need to. He saw the thief escape. And listen, all I want is the sword back. Meridian, and my family for that matter, has seen enough strife already. If I can get it back, all is forgiven. No retribution necessary. Okay. The sun is still not coming up. It's kind of weird. I guess it's scripted. I don't know. Don't ask me where to go if you're lost. My guard, not the town. Oh, look at that. What do you call those? Oh, look, there's the sun coming up. Sunrise. Oh, you get to watch the sunrise. Huh. And look, we can even see a thunder jaw over there. That's really cool. Gotta love this game. Oh, look, there's the sunrise. So pretty. Are there any more quests here? Watch out for the There's just more stuff to loot. Huh, what? Investigate the crime scene? Is it here? That was weird. Okay, I'm sorry, I just need to take a picture. It's just too damn pretty. Oh, what? I can't move the camera? Are you kidding me? That stinks. No, I don't like that. Ugh. Why, game? Why? What's with the tower? Oh, listen to the birdies. Okay, I'm getting very distracted right now. I'm sorry. I want to buy one of these. What's that? Is that how they generate power? Or is it just like an elevator or something? Smoking sweat? That's how you know you've done a good day's work. <laughs> Smoking sweat? Okay. Now, why can't you hold on to that? Hmm? My boss said he lost another caravan in the machines last week. Docked my wages again. All of them have full beards. That's nice. Oh, look at his slippers. Oh, 
Alright, can we get any more of these quests? Uh, it's kind of hard to navigate here. Because all of the gates are closed. Which kind of sucks. Where's this leading me? Is there... There's a map here, right? Yeah. Okay, there's a quest right here. Or well, two of them. Oh, there's a hunting lodge, too. There's another quest here. Jesus. Alright. I can't move the camera here. Right? No. Ugh, so annoying. That's why there aren't any pictures of Meridian. At least from the screenshots that I've seen. Right. Guerrilla Games, if you're watching this, please. Why won't you let us move the camera? So what are you selling? You're looking for artifacts. Yes, but I'm no profiteer. Sun King Avad has named me an envoy to the Banuk. Oh. I work on their behalf. Banuk looking statues. Looking for sacred relics to return to their homeland, Ben-Ur. Mm -hmm. I'm especially interested in wooden figures that are sometimes found near Banuk rock paintings. Mm -hmm. If you have any, I have valuables to trade for them. I do. Tell me more about these Banuk figures. Simple wood sculptures made by Arna, a legendary hunter who was exiled from Ban-Ur for killing his chief. He left the figures near painted stones in places that reminded him of his homeland. Later, his tribe declared him innocent. Now they see him as a kind of wandering hero and want those figures back. I do what I can to help him get them, including trade for them. If you have any. I do. But I'm not done talking. You said the king named you an envoy to the Banuk? Yes. I've been to Ban Ur many times, and the Wirek chiefs trust me. I help them maintain diplomatic ties with Avad. Some say they're a mysterious people. But their ways make a lot of sense to me. All you have to do is be the best. Doesn't huh. matter if you're born high or low, man or woman. They respect skill, not some fool notion of heritage. I see the appeal. I wish more Karja did. Anything they don't understand, they call backward or savage. Sounds like the American dream. You ready? Let's trade then. I'm ready. Oh, nice! I can buy one. What's in it? Is that it? I guess. Come on back if you find any Banuk goods. Will do. I pay well for Banuk relics, Outlander. I know, I heard you. Okay. Treasure boxes. Oh wow, lots of modifications, probably green ones, and I can just sell. Hmm. 500 shards, okay, that's a lot. Yeah, just... Well, there's a blue one. That's okay. <gasps> I cannot carry any more rocks. Okay. Safe to sit here. Where am I going? Huh? Some Oseron is building a mansion that will block my view. What's that? Do it again. Yes, the machines grow more dangerous, but what do you want the Sun King to do about it? We have other priorities. Huh. Oh look, there's a kid. I don't think you're wearing that right. <laughs> what? I look fabulous. What are you talking about? Who would willingly live on piles of little brat? From the old ones? This is a time of terror I saw. Able-bodied adventurers, preferably with no friends or family. 
But I'm not choosing. Merchants are going to put my family out of business if I'm not careful. That's a nice dress. Can I interest you in a reasonable share of a lucrative opportunity? And no, that's not creepy at all, me following you. Really like the dress, though. Oh, another nice dress. Where are they Your coming from? Is that... Services. No questions asked on my part. Like, what do you call it? Whorehouse? Maybe a church, I don't know. Oi there, Outlander. Name's Vilgund. Did you come to the city looking for work? Uh, oh, good shards. Enough to buy garb more becoming of your... Okay, stop oh, there if you pimp? want me to hear you out. I, I only meant uh, a well-molded woman such as you. Uh, <clears throat> I heard an interesting rumor about a Banuke camp. Tame machines, the rumor said. So I... Uh, I hired men to investigate. To just investigate, that's all. Those Banuk are canny. Too canny. I paid up front. Well, uh, half up front. I I've had no word back. So now you're hiring someone to find the last men you hired. <laughs> They're a sunk cost. This rumor's worth more to me. What's with the singing? What can you tell me about the Banuk? The Banuk women. Snow witches all. Cold eyes, cold... <clears throat> they choose to live up there in Ban Ur, in the ice. Trying to have a conversation, it's like chipping them out of the stuff. They prefer machines for company. That's why I'm putting my shards on this rumor. Then they might not want outsiders to know about this place. <laughs> Their mystic act. No care for possessions, for luxuries. Pile of slag. Those people bargain harder than the winter frost. Uh -huh. So is there any more to the rumor about this camp? <laughs> the last bunch just wanted to know about the reward. Hey, you're a smart one. This camp isn't even big enough for a name up where the snow won't thaw. They say the Banuk there live alongside machines. Peaceful as you like. Keep them, use them, sing to them. If it's true, if we learned how they do it, think how valuable that would be to all the tribes. When you say valuable, you mean they'd pay you for it. <laughs> Girl, I'm not made of straw. Are you some kind of merchant? You don't seem to have any wares. <laughs> of an explorer but you send other people to do your exploring <clears throat> all right more of an opportunist uh, girl nora girl <clears throat> huntress thank you we live in a world of opportunities risky opportunities but why should risk stand in the way of a lucrative prospect for the likes of me all right i'm more of a gambler he's a sleazebag if I did look into your rumor... You won't need to climb up the shoulders of the world for it. It's on the edge of Banuk land, beneath the anvil of the moon. And you look like you know your way around the savage east. Uh, um, the east. If it's true they walk among machines without fear in this camp, well... You can't miss that, can you? Payment on return. His teeth looked really good, like, for a game character, I mean. I wonder if the Banooks are over here. Yes, they are! Ha! I knew it. When he was talking about eyes, I knew a quest would lead me here eventually. Where does... Okay, that's where the main quest leads me. Alright, alright. I'm gonna make a weird cut here, but Can I interest you in a reasonable share of a lucrative opportunity? I just talked to you. Yeah, I'm gonna make a weird cut here, but I'll continue the episode.